Dear students, I welcome you all to this problem solution series in digital electronics. I am solving the problems from the book Digital Design by Maurice Mano and Michael Sileti. So in this video, I am solving the problem number 3.21 from the chapter number 3. The problem is draw the multiple level NAND circuit for the following expression. That means we are given here with a function f. So we have to draw the circuit of this expression using NAND gates. NAND circuit means we have to make a circuit of this expression using NAND gate. Let us first uh, express this expression so that we can implement using NAND circuit. Okay, f equal to w whole into x plus y plus z plus x y z. Okay, so this is the given function. So if we take two times complement, this is one time and this is second time so the function will be the same because if we take suppose a complement one time complement so if we take two times complement of a that means we will get a only one times complement it will be a and if we take another complement this complement and complement will cancel and will get a okay so that's why we are taking here two times complement so let us break this first complement so what we'll get w whole into x plus y plus z into this one whole bar okay a plus b whole bar equal to a bar dot b bar okay so b here is x y z whole bar okay so this is using de morgan's theorem now what we can do from inside of this bracket so we can rewrite it as w whole into so x plus y plus z Okay, we are considering this term. This can be written as x bar, y bar, z bar, whole bar. This is using De Morgan's theorem. Okay, so we have another complement here. Then we have x, y, z, whole bar, and whole complement. We can see that we have one term, this one suppose a and into b, a into b, whole bar. So we can use then get here. And similarly, if we take this to be one term a, then this one is b then a bar b bar whole bar okay now we can say that we can implement this function using nand gates okay so let us draw this logic diagram so this is the expression so we'll have w x y z so w have no bar okay so w this is the w input line okay then we have x and x bar okay x this is x line and we will use an inverter and we'll get x bar here okay then similarly y this is y input and we'll use an inverter and we'll get y bar here and and we have another input that is z okay so this is the z input and we'll use an inverter and we'll get z bar here first of all we will find out this expression this is oh sorry there is another bar okay so from this expression we can see that x y x bar y bar and z bar are multiplied then we have inverter okay so we can use a nand gate to implement this part of this expression x y x bar y bar z bar whole bar okay so x bar y bar z bar use a nand gate and we'll get here x bar y bar z bar whole bar now we have to multiply this with w and we have complement okay so we can use another nand gate okay so one input will be this one this input and we have to multiply with w okay so bring a line from here and give it to input so this one is w so w into x bar y bar z bar whole bar then we have nand get so we'll get this term so we'll get w whole into x bar y bar z bar whole bar and whole complement so here we'll find this one then we have x y z whole bar x y z whole bar we can find from here so x y and z okay use a nand get and we'll get here x y z whole bar okay so this is nothing but a nand operation between we have multiplied then we have inverted okay so it is a nand get now what we have this is one term a suppose this is b a bar b bar whole bar okay a b whole bar this term is a this term is b so a into b whole bar so what we can do we can use a nand get here 
Okay, so we'll get the function f here. Okay, so this is the solution of the problem number 3.21. Okay, so thank you for watching. If you have any question, please put it in the comment section below. Also, like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.